The threat of privatization was top of mind for Karen Littlewood. We cannot allow this government or any government to treat our public education system as though it's a, a line item in a budget and that it can be cut. And the president of the Ontario Secondary School Teachers Federation says that while bargaining talks with the government are in the early stages, she's expecting an offer similar to the one that CUPE received earlier in the week, which was offered a 2% raise for workers earning less than 40000 a year and just 1.25% for those earning more than that. Littlewood called that offer disrespectful for the work that teachers do and said that similar to the health care sector, the education one is having difficulty retaining workers and hiring new ones. She urged members to spend the coming days working with the public to gain support with possible job action looming. Because we need every ally we can get right now to support us and public services in general. The OSSTF's contract along with those of the other major unions expire at the end of this month. Labor Day is just less than three weeks away. Vasher Roth, City News.